Alright, first, a very quick crash course on wood science. Wood is a hygroscopic material, meaning it has the ability to take on moisture, to give off moisture. We're going to discuss how moisture moves through a mass timber element, and any wood element for that matter. Let's use an analogy looking at how we can say a bundle of straws is similar to a piece of wood in terms of how moisture moves throughout that member. All right, so let's say that, let's look at the end grain of both of these, and we'll say that the cells that run longitudinally throughout this cross section of wood also very similar to these straws. Now what that means is as, as this wood member starts to pick up moisture, absorb moisture, really what's happening is that's being absorbed into the walls of each of these individual cells as well as in some of the void spaces between the cells. So because of that, as the wood picks up moisture, it starts to expand in its cross grain dimensions. Again, the grain is running ver uh, longitudinally and it's expanding in the cross grain dimensions. The thing that's not happening for the most part is expansion longitudinally. So the length of this member really isn't going to change as it absorbs some moisture. Now the opposite is occurring as that wood member loses moisture, right? That's when shrinkage occurs. We start losing some of the moisture that's bound to these cell walls. We start losing some of the moisture that's in between the cells and therefore the member shrinks in its cross grain dimensions, but it does not really shrink longitudinally.